Welcome to the Windows channel and this is a tips and tricks video. If you experience any issues in Windows 10, you know that you can report these issues. There's something called the Feedback Hub and it's there for that. Now you might think, yeah, I got a little problem, Microsoft won't listen to me. You know what, from experience as a tech guy, I can tell you that when somebody has a problem, usually there are quite a few people that have the same issue. So if you have a problem, go to the Feedback Hub. You can uh, search it with Cortana. Just type Feedback and you'll see Feedback Hub, which is a Windows app. Things you can do there. First of all, search for an issue. So for example, say you've got Microsoft Edge Freeze, you can type uh, Edge Freeze and type Enter. Anything that has Edge Freeze in it will come in. You can check out Maybe something is uh, what you are looking for. If when you click on something, it gives you the information and you say, oh yeah, that's exactly what I have, you can click upvote. Upvote means that it's getting more importance. And the more upvote a problem has, the more chances Microsoft will take a look at it. So you can do that. You can also create your own feedback. What you do? click the add new feedback on the upper right corner start by posting by give give the maximum um, you know information so in the summarize try to be very very precise first of all so let's say um, edge freezes on YouTube you can say Microsoft Edge freezing on YouTube videos an example and then you've got optional more details. You can write more details up to a thousand characters as you see. Give the details that you have. If you have a problem that can be looked at, there's also a screenshot that you can attach. So by clicking attach a screenshot, you can do a screenshot and just attach it. They actually tell you also, press the Windows logo key plus print screen for a screenshot. You select the category for where this is. So for example, this is Edge, Microsoft Edge and IE. You select the type of thing that's happening. Uh, so whatever is going on, you just choose what's happening. So website issues, for example, here. Make sure that you click the problem at the top when it's a problem. And you see there's suggestion. You can also give information and say, well, I want to suggest something. Click the submit button, that's all that you need. And you know what? If somebody else has the same issue as you have, they will probably upvote and you are participating in making things better in Windows 10. It's very important to be proactive, to participate, to give your opinion. Microsoft has been quite good at listening to what uh, users want in Windows 10. And, you know, there's no reason to believe it's not going to continue. So why not use the feedback hub and uh, just, you know, voice your problems. It's a great, great place for that. You can also voice just some general comments of things that you'd like to see. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe to my channel. You'll be informed when new videos are online. Give us thumbs up. If you have any comments, questions, suggestions, let us know. And thank you so much for following us on this channel.